Right, here we are today looking at the Certican range of HGS pumps. I'm going to show one of the smaller pumps, a one horsepower single phase and a two horsepower three phase pump. Firstly, we'll have a look at one of the smaller pumps in the range of the HGS swimming pool pumps. This is a one horsepower pump and the fittings included with this are the same from the half horsepower up to the one horsepower pump. We'll run through the basic basics of the pump here. Here is the motor end and the uh, electrical connection box sits on the top. Then we move along to the wet end. Here we have the inlet, the filter basket and the outlet of the pump. The top of the filter basket is easily removed using the tool that comes with the pump. It just slots in the top, slackens it off. And you can just remove the filter basket easily. Now we'll run through the fittings that come with the pump. The pump is supplied with standard inch and a half fittings and metric fittings. These are interchangeable underneath the collars and locator on the pump. Here is the view from the wet end of the pump and as you can see the outlet from the pump is offset. I'll now turn the pump round so you can see the rear of the pump. and the view from the rear. Moving on to one of the larger pumps in the range, this is a two horsepower single phase model. The fittings that come with this are the same for the one and a half to three horsepower pumps. As before, we have the motor end and the electrical connection box. As we move to the wet end, we have the inlet, the filter basket and the outlet. And the fittings that come with this pump is the standard two inch Imperial and the metric fittings as well. Both easily interchangeable under the locking collars onto the inlet and outlet of the pump. The range of HGS pumps are available from half horsepower up to three horsepower in single and three phase. All the pumps in the range are suitable for salt chlorinated swimming pools.